Hayden and Ben from Carson Newman. Five Fish Limit today for 1306. Back at Lake Darnell State Park, Ben Coley at Hayden Gaddis from 10th ranked Carson Newman University weigh in over 13 pounds on the final day to jump from 15th on day one all the way up into the top three. We knew today that if we went out and caught what, close to what we had, if done a little bit more than what we had yesterday, we'd move up substantially. So, I mean, a limit on day two on this place is always huge. Pretty happy with the finish. Um, had a really tough practice, so to be able to scrape up a good finish from nothing is, is an accomplishment. Anglers from Louisiana Monroe, Connor and Dylan, one shy of a limit. They've got four that 11.95 yesterday. That's what we're talking about. Somebody might be ready to go home with the top 20 check here. Good limit today, 1274. We're going to talk to you guys. Just going to put you up there, 2469. Connor Nimrod and Dylan Nimrod from the University of Louisiana Monroe finished with a two-day total of 24.69 pounds, jumping up six spots to find themselves in second. Yeah, I mean, we were sitting tied for eighth after the first day, and really, we, coming into this thing, we knew that if we could get a limit both days, we were going to have a shot regardless of what they weighed. And, Going into the day, that's what we're looking for. We're looking for five bites, regardless of the size, and ended up one fish short, but we ended up getting two of the right bites, and that's what jumped us into second place. So overall, we did what we could and just came up one bite short win. All right, Matt and John Foster, your day one leaders had 1556 yesterday. They have a limit today. It needs to go 559 to take over the lead. Did y'all do just as good as yesterday, or did you, what'd you do, improve or worse? Man, we knew it was going to be tough today, and. Uh... We grinded it out, fished a lot of stuff different today that we did fish yesterday and put together a bunch. 11.53 right there, two day total of 27.09. Leaders of the tournament, Arkansas Tech, Matt and John Foster. Matt Higby and John Foster Case from Arkansas Tech University maintain their day one lead to win the APCO Collegiate Bass Open with a two day total of 27.09 pounds. Connor Nimrod and Dylan Nimrod from Louisiana Monroe finish in second and Hayden Gaddis and Ben Coley from Carson Newman take third. Well, we, we pulled out a win. We didn't think we had it in the bag, but we ended up winning by two and a half pounds, I think. It's awesome. I can't explain it in words. It's, it's crazy. It means a lot. We put in a lot of hard work on this lake. We've been fishing together. We fished through high school since we were like 11 years old. The tournament's out here. so. It means a lot to win a big tournament on our home lake. Following the APCO Collegiate Bass Open, here's a look at the national rankings for the Bass Pro Shop School of the Year presented by Abu Garcia. Adrian College holds on to its first place lead. The University of Montevallo closes the gap slightly as they sit in second, and McKendree University is in third.